Howdy, howdy. Well, folks, this is what I call a smorgasbord of car crushing. Got some Mercedes action, old school. Got some burned up cars. Looks like a Colorado. What is this, another Nova Chevelle thing? Not much left of it. What is this, an old school Porsche? Is it 911 or something like that? Man, that Colorado looks pretty straight. Dang. Burned up. We got just a few minutes, and then um, we're going to fire this crusher up. Just a couple more minutes. Oh, PT loser. Oh, GTO. I mean, that's what the trunk lid says. You could be yanking. Y'all see me yanking and yanking and yanking. I'm like, God dang it. And it's a push button. <laughs> I would say ladies' car. It smells of ladies' perfume. And there's some pink stuff. Looks pretty clean now. Hey, what happened? This one's on fire. One, wonder if both of these were like in the garage or something. Hey, who wants to crush? Here's some. Oh, come on now. Look at the way the door's locked. Dang. That road looks pretty straight. What is this? It's like a little MG rod or a little Romeo spider thing. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what, though. This right here is sort of a rare car, kind of. I mean, they only made like 34,000 of them. 82, 84. Somebody set a car on top of it when I got here. Or someone was already on top of it. But, I mean, you imagine how rare the camper shell is? Come on. Yeah, somebody snagged the badge already. GT spoiler. Tried to get the freaking door open, but... And then... Check this out, the lock. You see the other one across the car. It's like a it's like a twist knob. And it says lock goes up. What now? I'm turning it. I ain't getting no action. Where's the inside door handle? Easy. There's some broken glass. Oh, right there. Oh, we're, we got it, folks. We're in action. It even sounds like an old car. Oh, yeah. There ain't, well, I was going to say there ain't a tear in the seat, but there's one. How about that? Got a little tray for your knick-knack patty wax. Forty, forty-one thousand seven hundred forty-six miles. Sound like we got some action. Rampage, I'll at least pop that out, right? Dang, I don't want to get in that glass though. Dang. Oh, don't put your knee in that glass. Looks like it's almost about ready to rip off. That'll work. Look at that little chalk block. Dang, winter, winter chicken dinner. Hey, you know, Shelby actually, um, Carol Shelby put a couple of these cars together. There's a Shelby version of this. 
Hood prop, hood prop. Here we go, hood prop. Electronic control system. Back from 82. I think I use that stuff with my dryer. My clothes dryer. wonder if there's a date on the battery. Sometimes they write them on there. Well, I just that would give me a kind of idea, like, how long ago somebody was driving it. Is there a timing chain cover missing? Does it really go like that? And there is there a cover missing? Look at that. <laughs> look, look. The compressor's like half the size of the motor. I think they come with like 2.2 liter. Is this some aftermarket action? Holly? I don't even know if that I don't is it factory? I don't know. I've never heard of Holly being fat. I haven't, John Davis. Cowboy. Dude, we got two horn action. Dang. You will be heard. I mean, unless somebody put a fresh gasket deal on it, I mean. Oh, we got something missing over here. That'd be crazy if that was just totally exposed, that timer belt. Well, all right, folks, it's time. But this is what I call a, a smorgasbord. Oh, they put some mud tires on there, Explorer. Smorgasbord or car crushing. Hey, I need to find a blanket in the car. Chucky, the junkyard dog, his is all wet and nasty. All right, folks. We're going to get going. Pretty cool. We got a little bit of everything, right? I, we don't have a pickup truck. You know what else we don't got? A stupid Mustang. I'm living and loving over here. Gotta be careful, be kind. Poor little car.